Ooh, what's this? This is a cliff walk. Yeah, it's all steel. It's not the wood. Oh, we're under all, under all that. <laughs> You're the bizarre part. One of the most bizarre forms of life is right in front of us, right here. It's a living fossil. <laughs> it's a living fossil. So wh where is it? Where Where is it? The lichens. Lichens? Lichens are werewolves. <laughs> what the but this one's solid. This one's more solid. Perhaps. That's beam. pretty scary. Like a eight, ten inch beam, square beam. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That that's still pretty scary. Especially if it rips out of the rock. That's what's holding it. Oh my God! This is scary. Holy shoot! This is scary. Okay, oh, keep walking, Frank. Look it, look it. Keep keep walking, Frank. <laughs> keep going. Look it. Oh. oh my God, that's a little bit. This is actually even more terrifying than the uh, suspension bridge. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> this is really, really high. What's up? Come over. Come over. Come over and look up. Okay. Okay, oh, wait, wait. are you now, ready? Now look down. Now look down. All done. <laughs> stop. Why'd you make me do that? Because it's okay. Yeah, it's so Don't stop doing that. Okay. Don't do anything. I know, but just tempered glass. Just come here. <laughs> it's fine. No, it's not. Take your picture of the foot shot. Oh, yeah, you, get, yeah, you have yeah. a foot fetish. <laughs> this is a bizarre tree. It comes out and then it goes back up. This is actually a lot scarier than the suspension bridge. I don't know what it is, but it, I think it's just because there's no support. <laughs> At the bottom, it's just these metal beams. <laughs> it's oh man, I don't trust these things. We made it! Oh, look at this nice waterfall. Lichens are extremely sensitive to air pollution or your pollution. That's why when the when they're howling at night. It's because they don't like the air. Exactly. <laughs> Look at the power of water. 15 years of erosion. 25 years. That's like trend. 50 years. That's after 50 years. That's amazing. Ooh. Oh, see? I turned it off. Nice going. Okay. <laughs> I broke it. <laughs> we were just crossing that. This was probably the scariest part of the entire trip. That is so cool looking though. Wow, that is all held together with a metal beam, steel beam, and these cables for stabilizing. This is a great view of the suspension bridge. I can't believe like there's nothing in the middle. I don't know if I actually conquered my fear of heights, but I definitely challenged it. <laughs> I can't believe I just walked like through that thing. But honestly, the scariest part was just walking through that that a metal that bridge this one right here that was scary and there you have it so I had a really great time thanks to Frank May and Janine for being a part of it if your birthday is coming up I think that you should really do what you really want to do and you know if you want to just run around through the streets of downtown naked do that okay maybe don't well if you're a guy just do that like where away from where I'm gonna be but if you're a girl just let me know where and then I'll just have my camera <laughs> anyways what I'm trying to say is that 
It's your birthday. Get busy. Get. <laughs> what I'm trying to say is that, you know, it's your birthday. Get busy. Get <laughs> okay, that's not it. What I'm trying to say is that, if it's your birthday that's coming up, do what you want to do. It's your special day. And if you want to have a big party, have a big party. If you want to have a small dinner with your closest friends and family, do that. It doesn't have to be about a hundred people and making a huge drunken fest where you can barely remember. It doesn't have to be about that. So just do something that you really, really want to do. I mean, if you just if you just want to go to the zoo, go to the zoo. If, if you want to go to Chuck E. Cheese, go to Chuck E. Cheese. If you want to go to McDonald's and have a 20 piece nugget meal, do that. What it all comes down to is what you want to do on your birthday. As far as I can remember, all my birthday parties involved a lot of people with the consumption of over-the-counter legal hallucinating substances and I decided I don't want to do that this year and I think that you should also celebrate it with people that matter to you most your closest friends and your family and just do that celebrate that day with the people that matter the most to you so anyways that's all I want to say why don't you leave in the comment section below what you did on your birthday and if your birthday's coming up you can tell me how you're gonna celebrate your birthday this is Alex Yu and thanks for watching peace